E não tem jeito, né, galera? Mesmo o time da BBR desmoronando aí, perdendo 300 rounds seguidos. Olha só quem brilha no final, né? Nesse vídeo você vai conferir os melhores momentos da estreia da MIBR no Major E infelizmente, tem algumas falhas aí em relação ao tempo Obrigado, mano, Lord Mr. Swill RS, mano Que isso, velho Representou aí com essas adagas sombrias aí Revestimento enferrujado, né, mano E você, Popito Mel, já entrou aí no site da Nash Store? Já conferiu lá as promoções que tá rolando no Major? Mano, exclusivas, hein, velho Entra todo dia e utiliza o cupom do Japapita, é nóis. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, é, galerinha, vamos aqui conferir os melhores momentos da estreia da MIBR aqui no Major, o campeonato mais importante de CSGO, beleza? Começamos aqui com o Round Pistol e o Codizera já mostrando que chegou com o um dedo quente. You know, I've, I've been told, I'm not sure why Stewie wasn't spotted, his flashman came out late, but Codizera, I've, I've been told, has, uh, by Yanko, that he's never seen a more focused. Like more... É, meus amigos, os chineses estavam desesperados, eles estavam tentando entrar de qualquer jeito, mas, mano, Coldzera estava inspirado. Coldzera aqui, só um bom kill. Ventet quer seguir isso, mas eles estão caminhando em um momento e ele está fechando isso agora. Não há suficiente pressão do outro lado, deixando o Tarek disponível também. Então, whatever chances there were, eles pretty much desapareceram, em spite of a good opening there on Fur. Not able to make it happen. 3-0 in favor of MIBR and a good stoppage from Cold Sierra. O time inteiro da MBR tava jogando bem, tava com uma sinergia bem gostosinha, mano. Se liga aqui na movimentação do Tarik e do mano BNT. They're actually gonna jump down behind them. This is a really good move from Tarik to take down X Curate and Morris following Bentet gonna be taking him down in return. So a three on three and somebody hiding in the corner. That's a big kill. Finally, they get rid of the pit player in Cold Sierra. Now it's all on Fallen. He runs right through the headshot, turning around and spraying through the smoke. He's half health as well. Flashbang on Bent Head on the other side, but Fallen not going to follow through instead. He's thinking he's gone down into the pit. This play from Bent Head is just incredible. He's got him beat. Yeah, how do you get up into... He's not even in graveyard. He's actually just down on the low ground, ready and waiting and fallen. He has got no idea whatsoever there. That's a big surprise. Olha o espetinho de carne saindo. Tailu, so yeah. a lot of pressure on the Tailu team to not not just repeat what they did during Challenger, even if that worked, right? You still have to be a little bit more. Oh wow, that is a way to shut down that offense. Xcrit and Bentet. Pois é, meu amigo. O Fallen tava inspirado, tava passando a mandioca em todo mundo. Tava, mano, tava brincando com os caras. Se liga. Fallen with one kill, Stewie as well. He does get traded off, but fine with it so far. Fallen going in now with his teammates flashbang. He waited for it. Spots DD completely blind. Stops the plant. What a sequence from Fallen. The captain's got four kills. And he's put his team at a 6 to 1 lead. Dando aula. Eu não tô brincando não, tava dando aula mesmo, o menino. Challenge stage was that they were kind of a little bit fearless when it came to some of this stuff, right? So maybe that's the way to go back and just try and say, okay, if we slow play, we are going to get picked off. That's a nice shot from Excurit taking down Stewie. Now pushing for the smoke has fallen. This is madness, but it's exactly the kind of play we expect out of him and he's back through again. Oh my god. No scoping Bentet before the bomb goes down. Out of control, and Excrete gonna be dropped as well. Fallen now with 16 and 3. This is the world class level play. É, galera, 7 a 1. Todo mundo sorrindo. Parecia que o negócio ia ser lindo, gostoso, tranquilo. Dava pra tomar aqui nosso suquinho de laranja sem se preocupar. Fala imitando, subindo aqui no pau. Codizera dando os flick shot monstro. Mais um no scope aqui, mano. Parecia que ia ser fácil, né, gente? Pois é, irmão. Aí o tempo começou a se fechar, mano. Esse mano aí, Accurate, velho. Esse cara... Mano, esse cara aqui é foda, cara. Se liga nesse China. Zero making his way and he's got the op on the other side, so... This will be just a reaction test for both players. Hiding and trying to find time. He's gonna go for the fight and he wins it. That's a, such a big round for Tai Lu. And what, they had five or four seconds left in the plant? Mano, pra você ter uma noção de como os China começaram, mano, dar bala, 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 bala. Se liga nesse retake que os caras fizeram em cima do time da MBR, clã. 
Bomb is weirdly dropped on the ground. I obviously wanted to throw it over, but it's going to buy some more time, actually. Quite a few valuable seconds here for Tyler to get closer. The bomb is going to be down. So a full 5-on-5 five five retake. We don't see those every day. Tyloo, what have you got for us here? That one smoke on Bentet. Maybe he could cut off a couple of players, but instant headshot from Fur taking down somebody. And now they need to make this work right now. Excrit taking down Fur. It's a good couple of kills in returns. Do we get to get shot down? Excrit, more headshots and a little bit of a fight here. Captain Moore winning it, and it's all on Fallen. He's smoked off there on the bomb, defusing with the kit and everything. He can't find the lineup. Captain Mo will win it, and a great retake from Tyloo. That's so hard to do. Yeah, what a retake. That. Ai, mano, a casa começou a cair, galera. E esse Eckrit aqui começou a brilhar, brilhar, brilhar mais do que estrelinha. Oh, blind. He's got them all lined up. Could have gotten three, but Bentet can't get anything done. The HP is so low. The good thing is they fought such a forward battle that Excurit's gonna have the rotation in time. Drop the bomb on the ground, and it should be Tyloo. Man, that is a lot of damage for one UMP to be doing. Extra ready and waiting, taking down Cold Sierra and Tarek is going to be next. Can't win the round. Didi will take him down. Extra living through with the AWP and. Hey, galera, o negócio tava ficando tenso. Tinha aí a muralha chinesa tava voltando aí com o comeback monstro. Infelizmente aí o time da MBR tava apresentando aí algumas falhas que a gente já tá acostumado, né, Clã? Se liga aqui no tempo e a entrada dos meninos. Maybe even better at this point. So. A little bit of trouble there. Didi flashed in a little bit late to take top mid. Oh, he gets caught and almost is shot straight into space. I don't know what happened there. Now, 33 seconds and they're starting the wrap. There is a bit of backup coming in from Bentit and he does have a very important Molotov, but the bomb is making its way back and Excurit, is he going to stand his ground on that side? If Bentet stays alive, somebody's gone down, so now they're going to want to stay around. Captain Mo with one kill, but he has hit Fallen. That's such a huge kill, and just the fact that he heard that means he's going to call it in. They know it's some sort of B-crunch happening. Excurit, the only one who can keep this alive. Ten seconds, he has to get the kill. That's the bomb down. Oh, and one more flick taking down Stewie, and he saves the round. The sole defender on the bomb side. No tem jeito, né, galera? Mesmo o time da MBR desmoronando aí, perdendo 13. Olha só quem brilha no final, né? Finally, Cold Zero can take him down now. 15 seconds and a three on three and a huge chance here for MIBR to pick up a round. The Excrit taking down Stewie and Cold Zero now in a one versus two. But you know what? This is not a bad player to have left for a clutch like this. He's got no grenades, which is a bit annoying, but they're quite far away and they need to regroup and find a way to take this one home. They do have a kit on either player. DD setting up with a single flashbang, doesn't really touch him at all. And he's just ready and waiting. Hasn't even checked behind him for a good 10 seconds. He is just committed to this one position. Excrit walks right into the headshot and Didi will follow into the grave. Cold Zero, the great triple and a great clutch to put him on 13 rounds. That is beautiful. Ice cold from Cold Zero and you, you had it. I mean, he didn't even look behind him. He knew exactly what was coming. He was confused a little bit. Didi had taken out Tarek watching the flank, being a lurker, trying to eliminate that play. So he thought one was coming from Banana. He remained cognizant of the fact, but... Yeah. Amigo, você acha que só foi uma vez que teve a falha do tempo? Não, infelizmente. Não. Anybody's hands. This is a really strange maybe end to it. Captain Mo missing the chance. Didi will get one kill. Still got some bullets in the UMP and Fur is very low on health. They're running out of time quickly. That's the bomb with 10 seconds. Somebody needs to pick it up and put it down right now. Fallen running onto the site, but they line up. Bentet getting it and there's no chance. They can't win it. Cold Sierra, he can get the bomb, but there's they're simply gonna run out of time. What a mad end here to round number 26. É, dessa vez deixaram de novo nas costas do Codzera, mas infelizmente ficou muito difícil. Oh, gonna get run down right there, and Tarek taking him down, a little bit of a return. Didi also picking up a kill. Oh, that's a great flick, a quick triple for him. And Cold Sierra alone in the bomb site with no bomb planted, and they just need to wait for everybody else to get here. Didi, just hide and wait for it. There's no reason to overpeak this one. That was very quick. They had the bomb site completely swarmed, and Cold, he just wants that quick headshot. Has he been spotted yet? It doesn't look like Didi actually knows. He must have seen him by now. Cold is going to be going down now. 40 seconds, one versus two. Surely there's no way to get it out of this. He's got 11 health left. This would be a miracle clutch if he could pull it out. Sneaking in, an instant headshot there for Bentet. That was too much to ask, even for Cold. Fer, cadê você, Fer? Cadê você? Se alguém souber onde que o Fer tá, galera, comenta aí. Uh, 
been spotted as well. That's the bomb down, but a good reply as well, leaving just Excret in the pit. And they're going to pick up the bomb. Where do they want to go? 25 seconds. They need to make up their minds. This pit player could still be very, very lethal. They don't have any armor, so any bullets landing, you see how much damage it's doing. And Excret following up. Great play for the Indonesian here again. Então é isso aí, galera. Esses foram os melhores momentos do time da MIBR aqui, estreia no campeonato do Major. Quero saber o que você achou desse vídeo. Não deixe de dar seu like. Eu tô voltando pro Brasil. Vou pegar o airplane aí daqui a pouco. Se vocês querem conferir as stories, as fotos, não deixe de me seguir no Instagram. Beleza? Tamo junto e é nóis. Beijo na sua boca e tchau.